Alright guys, in this video I'm going to be showing you my ultimate health and defense build. Uh, and I'm also going to be discussing the madness in the market thing that has been spoken about on the Spartacus Legends Facebook page. I'm going to be talking about that right at the end of the video. So to start with, I'm going to be showing you my ultimate health and defense build. And I'm doing two-handed sword and I've gone for Jupiter's cock. Um, you could go for the Spatha of Mars, which does give you a tiny bit more health and defense, but I don't have the money for that at the moment. And you can actually get the Asterion Helm, which will give you a tiny bit more as well. Um, overall though, it's not that big a deal. Um, same thing with the Schemata of Divinity as well. Um, you can get the Segmentati of Talos, which is pretty cool and does give you a slight upgrade as you can see there. Nothing huge, um, but it is pretty cool. For the purpose of this video though, I'm going to be using the Schemata of Divinity. And um, I've actually chosen the Hearty Greaves of the Beast, but you can see the Ornate Greaves of Ruin do have a nice little upgrade. And also the Ornate Steel Greaves have a slight upgrade. So as you can see, I've still got a really high rating and quite a lot of damage. Uh, it's definitely not the class I would use. I'd like to have maximum damage and also maximum roll speed as well. Um, but some people who don't want to die early and just want to try and stick it out in a kind of a defensive manner This might be the way for you um, Next I'm going to be showing you the same class with the legendary Demarcaris Gladii So definitely stick around for that So next up is the exact same class using the legendary Dimarcaris Gladii and they are obviously the most powerful dual swords in the game and they're quickly becoming my favourite weapons to be fair. Um, I like Jupiter's Cock, I think it's a wicked sword but I just find these swords amazing. Um, I think that's down to the sheer damage of the weapons although the weapon speed of my class does help. Um, as I said before, I wouldn't actually recommend this. I would recommend the loadout that I've shown you in all my ultimate loadouts, which is a really agile and fast class, but this is for someone who wants to play a little bit more defensive and uh, make the games last a little bit longer. So I hope you guys enjoy this gameplay, and afterwards I'm going to be talking to you about the madness in the market. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and that it helped you out. I'm now going to be discussing the madness in the market and uh, you probably would have seen this on the Spartacus Legends Facebook page. Um, they don't actually say or specify what the actual madness in the market is so we can only guess. Personally I'm hoping that you can actually just buy everything with silver coins. That would be great and means I could just buy everything. 
Um, at the very least it should be 50% off but to be honest I think they need to do the silver coin thing just because most people don't want to spend money on gold and it's as simple as that. Let me know what you guys think the madness in the market could be. I'm thinking it's going to be starting in a few hours time. A lot of people are already complaining that there is no madness in the market and to those people you just got to wait a few hours. Normally it's about 4pm GMT when these changes are made so I'll be checking back then and I'll be making probably a separate video um, especially if it is everything for silver I'll be making a special video and basically just buying everything so uh, I hope you enjoyed this video please like and subscribe and I'll see you then.